Hello there everybody, here we are down the side of Enfield Bus Garage in the road that's known as Hearts Way where we park the uh, Electra line of the electric buses for the 307. Uh, I've just finished my shift and I just thought we'd have a quick look at one of the charging units. There's not many on charge tonight at the moment, but I'm sure they will be. So this is charging uh, that bus there to the front of us. Seems to be the only one on charge at the moment. And it's almost complete. It's got 99% charge in there. Don't know if you need to put a shilling in the meter. Those of you old enough to remember that catchphrase. Or is that a touch pad for your debit card? Just joking, of course. Not sure if we can see much up here, but we'll have a quick look. That light at the bottom there, it's actually a blue light, but it doesn't show very well on the phone because of the... Uh, the way the phone illuminates things but that's on charge in there and when you see the uh the lights lit up like that that indicates that the bus is on charge this one isn't so really i can't show you the whole lot i wanted to show you one or two more um but stay tuned i'm just going to stick a couple of photographs after this just to show you something that the engineers have got in their office very difficult to film down here at night, but there you go, you can see that one's charging that bus. So over in the engineer's office, they've got uh, a couple of displays on the wall. I don't know how clearly you can see this one. Uh, depends. If you're watching on your phone, you might not see it too clearly, but if you're watching on a, a larger screen, like a computer or a laptop, then you might see better. Um, this photo was taken quite late at night, so there's only three electric buses on the 307s at this time. But what this does, it's a bit like uh, bus times, really. Uh, it shows the map of the uh, local area, and it shows how many electric buses are out in service. And it shows the remaining battery charge to the left. Uh, it's highlighted in blue, you've got ES13, and it's still got 46%. In the middle there, ES1 on 26%, and on the right, ES9 on 34%. Now, the uh, standard procedure is that when it drops to 20% or below, you're supposed to call it in. Um, <clears throat> but in practice, we don't really do that because we know how much we need to do a round trip. Now, one round trip depends on the time of day, depends if you've got your lights on or your air con or whatever, but you, you work on the assumption of 10% for a complete round trip from Brimsdown to Barnet and back to Brimsdown. So if you've got one trip to do and you're on 18%, for example, you're not going to call it in because they're not going to change you over anyhow because 18% is plenty. Uh, on the other hand, if you've got, uh, like the other night, I handed my bus over, 29% on the charge. The driver had three round trips to do. He would have needed 29 or 30%, so that was too tight. So after two round trips, he subbed it over. And they gave him a DW. But uh, this screen is quite useful. And obviously, when you've got the full service out there, it's going to be a lot more little icons on there. But it was just a Sunday night, when, a Saturday night, I believe, quite late on a Saturday night when I took this photo. And then this screen here, well, it alternates. There's this, uh, you can see down the bottom, if you can see it, it says viewing two of two. Well, these just show the chargers in the garage. This is showing charging units seven to ten. You can charge two buses from each charging unit, and it just shows which charging units are in use. Hope you enjoyed this little video, something a bit different from the usual. I'll be back with another one very soon.